let me show you what to do if you can't connect your remote control with your E99 or E99 Pro drone. Maybe it sometimes works and sometimes doesn't work. So uh, the thing is, actually, these drones have a protection. So if it actually has been crashed and it has detected that it has been crashed, it actually can't be started up uh, unless you actually restart it. So we have to actually turn off this and also turn off the remote control. Then we have to actually place on flat ground, so you can't hold it in air and try to do that. It actually has to be on the flat, so it actually understands that uh, everything is okay and it's uh, it should be able to start. So the procedure is, we actually, uh, whenever we want to turn on these things, you actually have to turn on the drone first and it will flash like this and it will co calm down after some moment. So when it's in this state, as you can see, it's actually flashing not as fast. Uh, we can actually turn on the remote and it will connect. But uh, basically, if uh, if it only flashes like this, super, super fast, as you can see all the time, uh, it still thinks it has crashed and uh, yeah, it, it won't be able to actually connect. So uh, if, if it's still flashing, Again, uh, maybe like turn it on, off several times. Again, make sure it's on flat ground. And if it's still not working, we can even literally like uh, like remove the battery for a couple of seconds and let it sit like this for a few seconds and then simply insert it back on. So again, turn it on, simply first turn on your drone. Make sure it flashes like this and then press this and as you see it stopped flashing these lights and that means it's connected and we can use it also in this manual here here is a guide basically what to do if uh, if it still can't be connected so it has to be synced with this uh, remote control manually here as well and this is how you can do that so basically uh, again as it says it needs to be in flat ground then turn on the power switch on the remote and push this up till a beep and then uh, push down till again I think it beeps not exactly sure but try this what it says over here if you still can't get it to work so yep overall uh, that's the that number one thing I hate about this is that uh, crash detection system so it uh, always gives me problems so if it simply bangs somewhere it thinks it has crashed and it can't be started up again unless it's restarted and again we actually have to turn off all the both devices we can't only turn off this so if you actually try to connect without actually uh, like this being off it won't work actually so you have to actually turn off uh, both the drone and also the remote then again start the drone first wait till it finishes flashing and basically calms down a bit okay like this and again press and it should connect and it should work anyway